it true he got arrested for protesting? Protesting? That's what I heard. Up at the university. I don't really know. For setting rats free or something? That's quite cool. Whatever you're into, I guess. Well, I think it's cool. But his girlfriend does too, or hasn't he got one? Girlfriend. Man, he can be a dick. Mm, sorry. I just don't really know if he's got a girlfriend. I don't think he does. Like you tell me about his private kind of life. Yeah, I guess. Hey, if you want to talk to him, I know where he's going to be after school today. You know that sports shop at the mall? Yeah. That's where he's going. Okay. <laughs> Wait and see. You are so bad. Hey. Fatty told me about Jesse leaving the flat. Maybe you got a chance to straighten things out. Call it okay. You can contact her, then. Eh? Nope, I've got the hard word. No way. Judy. I wouldn't let that stop you. I'm sure, I know that you're not convincing me. I'm a bit annoyed at the way she left. I'm going to have to get another flat made and we'll lower the mortgage payments. Don't keep you stuck for kids. No, thanks. I'm all right. that trolley ever do to you? People are stupid. The whole universe is stupid. True. Uh, any particular people? Any particular universe? Look, come for a drink with me tonight. What are we talking here? I'm not up for an all-nighter. Just one drink. I can handle that. So, yeah, that's the height there. Yeah, yeah that's, that's a good height. Yeah, cool. Um, that should be fine. I'll just have a little bit of Thanks. The last take was pretty good. Good take. He can do better. How many times does he have to do it? Until oh, it's perfect, I guess. But hey, Miss Tama, only the best is good enough. Yeah. He's so lucky. I wish I got to do what I love doing all day long. Not much money in it, though, is there? True. No. No, cool. But hey, wouldn't you hate living in those big mansions, getting gigs all around the world? But hey, when you do, remember, I was at his first recording session. How's the sound up there? Yeah? From the top, Tama. This one's for you, Shad. Give me something interesting. Bleeding hemorrhoids in two, peptic ulcer in three. Oh, I love my job. Uh, I'll handle the ulcer. Very kind. Uh, Judy, I could use some advice. It's kind of personal. Sure. Chris is PA, Barbara Haywood. Mm hmm. Well, last night at the meet and greet, I got the distinct impression that she was, well, interested in me. When I told her that I wasn't interested in seeing anyone at the moment, it didn't go down too well. Oh, nobody likes rejection. Yeah, this was over the top, though. Is there something I'm not picking up on? Uh, the short answer is no. No, I wouldn't worry about that. I only mention it because I keep on getting on the wrong side of people. Every time I open my mouth... The thing is with Barb is that she's a little excitable. Fired up one minute, completely over at the next. I'm adding to the drama by worrying about it. And that's my experience. No, I should just forget it. Absolutely. Thank you. Am I wrong or is she something of a man eater? Uh, stop right there. Barb and I are very good friends. Okay, I'm kicking myself Ooh. again. This is Kerry, 16 years old, got kicks in the chest playing rugby. Hello, Kerry. He's having trouble breathing. Okay, straight through to recess. She'll be there now, hanging out at the sports shop. <laughs> Chelsea, browsing for sports gear. Dump hours more like. She'll feel so at home. You are so looking for trouble. But I heard Jack making plans with his friends. How was I to know he'd change that? <laughs> I wonder how long she'll wait. We should have gone to what? No way. We'd be history. And besides, it's out of school hours. She can do what she likes. And photo of her hanging around still would have been cool. We could have made a poster. Diva of cool mix fashion statement. Cricket whites are the new black. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be so funny. We can do it. I've got a digital at home. You reckon she'll wait that long? For Jake, it's got to be worth a try. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what day does your brother have soccer? How would I know? Answer the question. I said I don't know. Today. So he was never going to the mall, was he? I told you what I knew at the time. Don't blame me if he went to soccer practice instead. You set me up. And guess what? You're going to pay for it. What's up? Nothing much. Have you met Chelsea? Hi. Hi. 
Tosh and I will have a coffee, thanks. Sure. What's going on? Nothing. <laughs> cool, that's right.